Hello everybody, this is the second uh, session of Microsoft Word tutorial. The version of uh, Microsoft Word we use it uh, 2010. Okay, we open the Microsoft Word. I choose uh, the one of my uh, document for this tutorial. Now I wanna teach you the home toolbar. This one, because this one really useful uh, for you if you wanna write your project assignment or write letter for the, or uh, letter for your friends or uh, type a document in your office. This toolbar is really important for you and you must know all the things in this toolbar okay the first part is clipboard I think maybe uh, some of you know about this option but uh, because I wanna teach uh, for the all the levels I show you how to can use uh, this clipboard for example if you wanna copy this title you can click on copy or control C if you see control C and after that for example a space a space a space control V or paste paste or control V yes paste or because this is my uh, document and I undo this okay and you can cut for example you cut this line and paste I don't know two line later example here or cut control X control X or cut cut and control V or paste here okay it's really easy I think uh, it's not uh, explain more than this okay here uh, this is your uh, <coughs> font my font uh, for the English language the best font for using is Times New Roman and most of the uh, person use this one or use Arial Black Arial not Arial Black Arial this one Arial or Time New Roman both of them is really useful and uh, most of the people use these two fonts for English language okay you can use this and you can change your size font size for example 14 or 16 and you can easily from here uh, grow your font for example 18 20 or shrink your font 18 16 14 12 really easy with this option you can bold your uh, line if your line is really important or the title you can uh, bold for example this one is the title of this paragraph then I bold it and you can uh, italic italic and if you like you can underline okay this is my uh, title in this paragraph then I choose bold italic and underline 
and for example um, something uh, is wrong or not important uh, you can use for example I choose this one and use strike true you see if not correct for example in uh, some sentences sentences uh, you said this word or this is the uh, wrong way for or for example for this company you can this this one uses for the mathematics for example R2 for 2 you use yeah, R2 and this one superscript for example R or oh, sorry here R to can use this R2 this is the superscript and this one is the subscript this is both of them uh, more uh, useful for the mathematics and you can uh, use uh, this to for the your mathematic uh, I don't know formula it's really easy this one not included in uh, Microsoft Word 2007 and 2003 this is the new option in the Microsoft 2010 and because of that I suggested to uh, use the Microsoft Word 2010 because really easily to use okay this one uh, text effect if you wanna I don't know for your title uh, use the text effect you can choose this and for example use this effect you see it's really nice this is really good maybe for some title or some uh, I don't know uh, your assignment this is the <coughs> your font color but you know because this one is the text effect cannot for example for this one I use and uh, change the color you know my font color now is a uh, change okay it's really easy and this is the background of your font for example if you wanna choose the background for your font you can for example yellow background or uh, for example these sentences is really important in your paragraph you can choose a background for your uh, sentences and this one and this is really new and really good for the Microsoft 2010 for example if I use this line I choose this this is the your sentences case this is your same but if you use lowercase all the word is lowercase if you use uppercase all of your word is use uppercase it's really good if you use capitalize each word uh, every word the first one is capitalized you know and if you use toggle case this is I think uh, like as the chatting you know it's really good uh, option for you if you wanna this if you wanna uh, go to your previous format you can uh, click on the sentences case okay and this is the clear the formatting for example 
if you want to unformat this you can only use this one clear all the formatting okay this one bullet for example if you wanna let me do for example for this one I bullet when you enter the other bullet the door is closed other that other bullet the door is open this like has the number but uh, maybe you uh, input your paragraph like as this uh, you can use the bullet because you cannot use or not really good uh, use the number same as this better you use the bullet and the bullet uh, have a lot of uh, format you can uh, choose each format you like this one or this one and this is the number yes this is the number and this one multi level list but when you use the number yes yeah no okay this one for the uh, text from left when you uh, click on this this is the, your text but uh, you know all my, uh, my text is from left if you wanna I wanna choose this one all of my uh, uh, text from right this is useful for Arabic language or Persian language and some uh, language uh, start from right side you can use or this one middle yeah. or this one justify justify is really important uh, if you wanna uh, organize and uh, some people see your letter or assignment is really good uh, you must uh, use justify or justify you know yeah if you see my uh, now my uh, all of my sentence is justify uh, okay I think uh, for the this session is enough uh, for the next session I wanna teach you from here uh, because this toolbar is really important I must uh, spend a lot of time uh, for uh, teaching you okay the next session I'll show you other tools in this menu thank you very much